guys, this, this side of the hood looks really bad right there. So we're gonna follow that light right into the other side that I've already polished. Yo, what is up guys? It's finally time to start polishing this 2015 Cadillac Escalade. It's 1030 at night right now. I'm gonna work for a few hours as late as I feel like I can make it. And we're gonna knock this thing out. First, I'm gonna go ahead and show you a couple of the panels, what they look like before I start polishing. And this is after I've already washed the car. Check out this hood. You can really see the oxidization, the watermarks, some scratches. Uh, the paint is all like this. You know, you can see it best on the hood because of the up lighting, but the entire body of the truck is like this. You can just see that. That's caked on there. And we're gonna get this corrected.
half of this hood already polished. And yes, there's definitely some scratches, some deeper scratches. There's some, uh, you know, little bubbles in the paint, oxidization, everything. But I cannot chase perfection on this job because I would literally be here for two weeks, longer, I don't know. Um, I'm really OCD about this stuff, but what I'm gonna say is, um, it's like a night and day difference without me having to sand. I'm literally just using some heavy cut on a heavy cutting pad on my DA and we're knocking it out to uh, what I think is acceptable. And I really would like to do a better job, but this is just, this is just gonna have to do. So without me talking anymore, I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys what we're working with. And you could tell me what you think. And right now, if you're seeing this in the video, please leave a comment in the section below and let me know what you guys think. I really would love for everybody to watch my videos, enjoy what I'm doing as much as I do. I guess that's how I could say it. Um, but I understand that's a long shot. It's so much better. Let me see if I can get it from here, this shot like. We're gonna peel back this tape, wipe it down, and then I'm gonna show you guys after the tape lines are removed. But I just wanted to show you from that shot right there with the tape on it still, what that kind of looks like when we hit the lights on both sides of the hood. I might be able to get a good shot from here because I, I can see in my eyes, this, this side of the hood looks really bad right there. So we're gonna follow that light right into the other side that I've already polished. And I'm sure you can see some scratches. Like I said, I cannot chase perfection on this job because I'm working on a bit of a timeline and really I'm just, I'm looking for this kind of result. It's so much better than what it was. Like there's some pretty heavy scratches here, here. I mean the whole truck, it is so beat. And like you guys could see that from the interior, how beat this truck is. So you can see I have my work cut out for me. But uh, I'm gonna set the, I'm gonna set this, maybe I can grab the tape from here. I got my ladder. Wipe down that center line real quick. By the way, guys, if you've watched my past few videos, I've been talking about my new tripod. And it is here. I'm using the new tripod right now, which actually helps me immensely. I'm able to reach places I couldn't reach before with the video. It's standing so much higher than it previously was also, which super nice. I'm using some real thick cutting compounds, so it's got to take a little rubbing to get it off. Usually I would use like a spray detailer or something, but we're just not there yet. Okay, here we go. Before my camera dies, because we're almost there. Gotta get a better battery for this thing. All right, let's do this line. Ready? Holy smokes. You could just totally tell. It's a night and day difference, and I'm really happy with the results so far. That hood, that's half of the hood already took me about an hour, believe it or not. Um, but I'm gonna continue to work and get as much of this done as I can. That is crazy. Seeing that line is just insane.
So there you have it guys, that's what I'm working with. You see I've done half the hood, it's not perfect, but it is a night and day difference and I'm happy with it. So this is what we're gonna go with. Um, I'm gonna do the best I can with uh, what I'm working with and I could do a lot better than this even I suppose. Like I could sand this, I could do some block sanding and Trizac and I could almost eliminate all these scratches but like I said, I can't chase perfection on this truck this will do the job it's gonna look so much better and i think you guys can agree so if you guys are watching please give me a thumbs up subscribe leave a comment in the section below if you think this came out good i know some of you guys will but if anybody that watches the video to this point if you'll leave me a comment let me know that you guys are enjoying this because that really makes the difference in me making more videos if anybody likes it i really that really thrills me and that's what I'm going for here. I want you guys to enjoy what I'm doing and um, I've put a lot of work in this truck and I'm almost finished with it and we're gonna be starting other projects soon after that. And I'm really looking forward to those things too, but this is just something that has to get done first. So I'm gonna continue to work on this. I'm gonna work my way down this side of the car or this side of the truck and um, hopefully get this thing done in the next like day or two. But it's a lot. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn the camera back on a time lapse. It's still late at night. It's like, at this point, it's 11.54 and I wanna get some more work done before I have to go back home. Thanks for watching, back to work.
I secretly don't even want to admit to you what time it is. It's 1.30 a.m. And I've only gotten half the hood, that panel, and half the door done. I think I've taken a little too much time. Like I said, I'm really into like perfection. You, but you, like without the, without highlighting, you can hardly see a difference. Um, you know, under sunlight, under some sunlight, under the LEDs, you can really see the difference. You know, you see this one pretty good. Um, but I don't know, maybe I'll pull it out if it's sunny in the next couple days to see what that's going to look like. But I think I'm taking a little too much time. Um, I really am like a perfectionist while I'm polishing and this truck is so far from perfect. It's disgusting, but I'm like, I guess you could say almost a quarter done, not even, um, cause there's a lot of nooks and crannies I'm going to have to get in there, but that's it for tonight. So if you guys watch this video, I really appreciate it. Stay tuned because I'm going to make a full video on the entire detail of the truck. And I'd love for you guys to see that. But, uh, for tonight I am out of here and I'm very busy this weekend. So I ain't even going to pick this back up till Monday now. So I'll be catching you guys Monday. Thank you so much for watching and have a good weekend, guys.